Designers in Russia are using new techniques to make human attributes on the next breed of robots that could be used in shopping centers, museums or care homes. Not just realistic, but attractive. At least that's the plan. Here's Arun Iyengar. With an eye to the future, 3D modeler, sculptor and designer Pyotr Chegodaev uses art to humanize robots. I plan to make a 3D modeling center where we develop artificial skin, eyes and teeth for our hyper-realistic robots in this rapidly developing market. This lab in the far eastern Russian city of Vladivostok is developing a prototype of a male humanoid robot called Alexei. Mass production is scheduled to start by the end of the year. Eventually, these robots are intended to have a full body and legs and be able to move. Right now, we supply robots to the government centers in Moscow and various Russian medical universities. There is also a large and promising market in the United States where universities are also interested, and we've already signed some contracts. Some fear a time when robots overtake humans. This combination of art and technology may hasten the day. Right now, they're doing well to be getting haircuts during lockdown, quite frankly. But if one day the mask does slip, perhaps they will at least console us with that very human of sayings that imitation is indeed the sincerest form of flattery. Aruna Iyengar, BBC News.